One year before the presidential election, we took to the streets of Washington, D.C. to demand justice on race, climate change, and immigration. The political system is failing us, so we're taking these crises into our own hands. Right now, our generation is in crisis. We are strangled with over $1 trillion of student debt. We are locked up in prisons for profit. We are denied ownership over the means to our own survival. Our environment is hurting. Our communities of color are hurting. Our country is hurting. We are here to participate in the first, the biggest youth mass civil disobedience where movements for racial justice, for climate justice, for immigrant justice will come together! to indict a system that does not work for young people and people of color. I'm angry because I have known about climate change since I was a child and nothing has been done. It's gotten worse! We need to reinvest into the black families where one in three African American men will go to prison at some point in their lives. Immigrant communities continue to be criminalized and we cannot stand for that. Presidential candidates of 2016 need to stop paying lip service to our issues, but actually come up with serious policy actions that they are going to take in 2016 and beyond. It doesn't take extraordinary people to do extraordinary things. It takes people with a good mind and a strong heart and the courage to stand up for yourself, to stand up for what's right. What do we do when our communities are under attack? Right here, right now. This is our generation, our choice.